behave. Find out more at outsiders.org.uk forward slash let's stick together. Welcome to Red Valley, home of the elusive blue-tailed deer, McKinley Breweries, my great aunt Ada, the infamous Mohawk Canyon, and some of the biggest, meanest firestorms in the world. Good luck. Through the Flames is a first-person cooperative multiplayer firefighting game built around teamwork and communication. Red Valley's dense forests, looming mountain ranges and winding valley roads mean that coordinating with your team is key to your fight against the Flames. It's up to you and a group of up to six other teammates to decide how to face the Inferno. Use information such as wind speed, weather forecasts, temperatures, fire types and terrain. Be they roads, lakes or bridges to determine how you fight the blaze. You'll have objectives to fulfill, such as putting out fires in specific quadrants, making fire breaks or retrieving unique items for Red Valley citizens. Every game plays out differently as you'll never know what Red Valley will throw at you next. It could be a communications blackout, unreliable weather forecasts, vehicle breakdowns or having a bear cub as a co-pilot. You decide where you deploy and you also decide what you bring with you. Make a custom loadout from a wide array of firefighting equipment from fire axes, first aid packs, chainsaws, flare guns and flamethrowers. Fight the fire from above in a wide selection of firefighting aircraft including the iconic Super Scooper. Drop straight into the heat of the action as an elite smoke jumper. Or keep the inferno at bay from the ground. It's up to you. Welcome to the team, rookie. fades. The machine becomes weightless, just disappears. And all that's left is a body moving through space and time. That's where you meet it. You feel it coming, creeps up on you close in your ear. ask you a question, the only question that matters. Who are you? Ar pethau bychain yn adio i fyny, paid bod nhw ystrafus gyda dŵr Cymru.
I was 35 weeks pregnant the day I received my cancer diagnosis. I had stage 3 bowel cancer. At that moment, it's like someone presses the pause button on your life. It's probably the closest experience I've had of time standing still. In that instance, there was no forward, no backwards. Just the suspended moment which announced how life was now devoid of certainty. I experienced the most joyful time of my life alongside the most terrible. And now, I'm telling my story in the hope that there won't be many more like it. Tell your story at nevertooyoungukorguk